Whoa! We are live! What's going on, everybody? Blue Raven, we're back. Dark Souls Remastered. Uh, in the last video, I gave you a how to farm some stuff. Um, I did mess up with the birds. I still haven't uh, figured out quite where I'm supposed to go, where the bird's nest that I do leave the stuff in. So if any of you know, leave a, um, leave me a comment. Um, I haven't YouTubed it yet. Uh, I kind of do some of these videos in bulk. And so, um, I'm trying to adjust my mic so I'm not so damn loud. Sorry for if I'm like, um, I did farm, uh, while I was off. Uh, in between recordings and I went ahead and got my decks up to 17 it was at like 11 or 12 I need to get to 20 to use my bow so I can take down the kite dragon which is only worth 10,000 souls but I just want to take him down just because I want to show you guys everything so um, yeah and it actually brought up my um, damage for my weapon a little bit because it does have an e scaling in deck so I get perks from both decks and strength with this weapon so I mean, it's not the greatest of scaling, but it, it, it does its job. Um, so on this video, we're going to switch to, we're going to go back to our life ring. There we go. Give us a little bit of life lap back. We are going to rest. And we are actually going to rest again because we're going to be warping to Inner Londo. In this video, we're going to go into the DLC. I don't know how far we're going to get into the DLC. I don't know if we're going to take on Artorias today or tomorrow. Um, I mean, we're going to be fighting a boss right away, so, um, and, uh, he's not, he's, he was, he's not super hard, but he's not easy either, so, he's not a pushover, in other words, um, he's like this, uh, um, I don't know, like a Cerberus scorpion wolf thing that you gotta fight, he's the, he's the guardian, we need this guy to move, you, move, yeah, one hit. You. Uh. Ah, he's dead. Two hits kills these guys. That's fifteen hundred souls every time you kill them. Just throwing that out there. So when we put the um, the Lord vessel down, the big cereal bowl down, um, it opened up the path to uh, uh, Grand Duke's Grand Archives. Ooh, my voice is messing up. Hold on. <coughs> Excuse me. And it opened up this path up here to Duke's Grand Archives. And we can go up here. We, we're not actually going to do the archives yet, but we're going to go up here. These freaking pigs, man. You got you can't hit them from the head. You got to hit them from the side. So, we got, come on. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're a bull all of a sudden. You're not a pig. There's like three of them here. So, if you haven't gotten them, them, the helm, their helmet yet... These guys do respawn. I think that no, they don't respawn. Uh, but you do have a couple more chances of getting it. You just gotta get behind him and poke him. You hit him in the face, you'll, your your weapon will bounce off of him like you're hitting a shield. So there's that. And there's one more around this corner up here. You when we get closer, you'll start to see his tusks. See them? So there's two of them actually. Oh, come on. You bring your butt out here. Come here. Plop, plop, plop. I'm a pig. Are there any pigs in Dark Souls? Uh, three? I don't think there was. Uh, I don't want to go in there yet. Don't hit me in there. I said don't hit me in there. Ow. Up. We got 29,000 souls on the line. We don't want to lose those. Um, but yeah, so I did farm off in between videos because I do these videos in bulk. And so I'm doing this video the same day I did the how to video. There you go. Fang Borhelm. Um, I'm doing uh, the videos um, the same day, but in between the videos, I did go to uh, uh, the Painted World and I farmed for. I actually went on my timer and I timed it, and I uh, it took me 12 minutes to get 100,000 souls. So it's a legit farming technique. We're just lighting this bonfire for now. We don't need to rest out or anything. We just want to light it. 
Um, and then we're going to come up here, pull this lever. This will take us up into the, the archives. Uh, we're actually not going very far in. We just need to go in to get one thing, and then we're going to be leaving. We just need to grab an item over here. These guys, these hollow crystal guys. Ow, ow, they can hit hard because they have crystal weapons. And crystal weapons are beast. Man, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. What, what is going Why am I not... Why am I not artooing like I want to? Ow. Drink again. Stupid crossbow dude. Kick him butt. That's the that crystal golem up there, that's who we want. That's what we want to do. Kill him. Where about him? Can we backstab you? Thank you. And then We just want to kill him. Okay. I have no stamina. What? Oh, I fucked it up. Hold on. We did this wrong. We did this backwards. My bad. I thought we had already let. Um, I'm an idiot. Uh, these guys will drop their uh, their crystal sword so if you're trying to get the perk to like max out a crystal weapon um, but you don't really want to buy one you can just come here and get one of theirs and then just go to the blacksmith and use the proper crafting tool and max out so you can get the achievement for maxing out a crystal weapon crystal weapons are some of the most powerful in the game however they cannot be repaired and when they break you need another one that's the downfall of crystal weapons we actually need to go to um, what's the quickest route uh, warp we need to go to Undead Parish. So yeah, we're probably just we're what's gonna happen is we're gonna just get into the DLC. We're not actually gonna do anything in the DLC. I'm gonna show you how to get into it and then we'll uh um and then on tomorrow's video we'll um uh, Yeah. In tomorrow's video we'll um do the uh uh DLC. So we wanna go past Andre. By the way, uh, so the giant didn't have a thing to uh, make my weapon better. And he doesn't have anything that says ascend either. Unless it's in their modify. See, I can turn it back into an ocelot or a cult club. If, is it occult or ocelot? You guys tell me. Um, I can turn turn it back to that, but I can't like ascend it. I can turn it back into a regular club too, but there's no ascending, and I can't reinforce it either. But on my other game, I have a plus eight one. I think I'm missing an ember. I think that's what's going on. Like there's an ember in my other game that I have that I don't have in this game. But yeah, please let me know if I, what the hell is going on with that because I don't have a clue. So, we're going to go out here and we get to the puddle. We're going to make a right. We're going to kill these two little forest dudes. And kill them. It's probably blood watch. Nope. I was like poison. We're pretty much done with all the poison in the game. I think. Oh! That guy. And again, we wanted to go make this right, right here, and then work our way on down. Working our way on down. Oh man, that's right. I could have just went through. Um, took the elevator. There's an item down there. Is that a crystal lizard or an item? Might have been a crystal lizard. 
Because I know there's a crystal on this thing, too, that I might not have gotten yet. There's a knight on here, too, if I haven't killed him yet. Okay, where'd the item go? Oh, there it is. Uh, oh, it's just the leather armor. Oh, the longbow. That's good. Oh, we can drop down right here. I'm like, where the hell do we go from here? Okay. And then we want we could have came from right there. We took the long route. I make an idiot. So we already defeated the Hydra. We don't I don't care about these little crystal golem dudes. There's only one I care about. So we're just going to RLH past these dudes. No, excuse me. You guys are slow and and awkward and annoying. We need to go this way. I don't have any Homer bones either. I'm all out of them. I need to. I I was really thinking about putting my faith up just so I could get. Home. I need. I think you need 16 faith to use homeward, which is a spell. And I think. I think on any build you should just get 16 faith just to have that spell. There's a gold golem. That's what we're looking for. We didn't do this yet. That's why we didn't get anything at Duke's Grand Archives. As you can see, he's kind of a pushover. And there we go. There she is. So, most great. I am. I come up so. My. My. What? Yes. And she'll disappear. And then if you go back where we just were, where the golems are, you'll see a summoning sign on the ground. And you can talk to her. And then her, her body will actually appear here. And you'll be able to get her armor. Uh, we need to talk to her well, at least once before we can go into the DLC. I think I could be wrong on that. I think I, I think once we let, release our other crystal golem, I think we can go into the DLC. But just to be on the safe side, we're gonna go over here and see your summoning sign over there. We gotta kill some. Now we actually have to kill him because we need to talk to her. Go away. Go away. These guys are coming too. What? 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 What's your wire? You wish. Here's another enemy that we never see after Dark Souls One. I made a really stupid comment in one of my early episodes like, oh, this is like one of the very few enemies that didn't carry over from 1. Now, there's actually a lot in Dark Souls 1 that they don't make it in 2 or 3. So, yeah, you can summon her right here. I am Dusk. It is not I Dusk. Learn Jester. Proper Bow. We can purchase. She sells uh, some faiths, uh, hidden body, uh, casting light, which would be good in the catacombs if you didn't have the bug eye, bug helmet or the lanterns. You can get that from her. Uh, repair weapon, which is always good. Chameleon, you, when you're being invaded, it's always really good. Hidden weapon, uh, really good when you're being invaded too, so they don't know what kind of weapon you're using. Um, she also sells this. Uh, my understanding is you should buy everything from her. Even it doesn't matter. Just buy everything. For a very long time, so, the sorcery, it that. so just. The sorcery. Okay, so now she's. Exp uh, we've used up all her dialogue. Now, if we go back over here, um, there should be a body now here. We have 14 minutes. Yeah, we're gonna. We're just gonna barely get into the DLC. I think. 
we're just gonna get there and then uh um oh and somebody else asked called me out on the on the boss in the dlc i call it like a like a cerberus or whatever the opening boss is like a kind of like that it's like a cat thing you see there's an item there now um but uh the final boss the 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 darkness is actually like a big monkey thing that's what i meant to say so i apologize for mischaracterizing a boss we got this there's there's dust so there's dust body that's her body because it's got her armor on it and she's from the past that's what you gotta understand the silly thing is because we don't have any homer bones I used the last one in um, where was I I don't know where I was but I, hit, I used it and I was like oh man I can buy more but it is what it is. We just have to do some running. You know what? We're going to do a little bit faster running. Tired of this water slowing me down. I believe there's a bonfire right up there, but we're not going to go to it. We're gonna do that. We're gonna do that late, very, very late game, um, because I, I don't know if she has anything else to say to me. I just got her armor. Nope, she says the same thing. Okay. So, uh, basically, we just want to run up and to the left. We gotta head back to uh, Duke's archives again. There won't be any pigs to stop us this time, and all we'll have those crystal knights to deal with, the hollow crystals. And uh, this is where I was trying to go. I thought I thought this is where Havel was. Remember? So we're back in Undeadburg, and we can. Uh, just go up here and go to the bonfire over here. And warp to Anorlando. No move. Ouch. I actually hurt. It's because I'm not wearing any good armor. Like I just don't want a mid roll. That like even the small mid roll annoys me. So I don't even want to do that. So that's why I'm wearing all the light armor. Um I could I could wear Ornstein's armor and I'd probably be in a good bid roll with Havel's ring on. Um Thank you for the arrow. We're gonna warp to Anne Orlando. Nope, warp, Anne Orlando. We're at 18 minutes, so we're gonna get this and then we're gonna we're gonna go warp back to Firelink, run through this, run through Undead Berg, because that I can't teleport to Oh no, we don't. We don't have to run through undead bird wait how do I get uh so if I go up the elevator if I can go down the stair that ladder I don't know I should have looked where that ladder went to again so I remembered then you can just go up the elevator and take the ladder and it'll take you right to there it's alright though we can run through undead bird you need to move. You, you drop anything? You did not. <coughs> Let me clear my throat. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hope everybody's having a good day. Um, enjoying the videos. Uh, you guys are you guys are doing great with that like. You guys are hitting the like button, leaving comments. I love the comments, guys. Um, um, you guys are just you guys are just awesome. That's all I can say. You're just fantastic. I'm happy to do these. Like, I was telling my wife, you know, if I got one, even if I could just get one comment on a video that's like, hey, you're doing a great job. Keep it up. That's makes my whole that makes all this worth it to me you know even one person just telling me I'm doing good makes it totally worth doing so um, you mean the more the merrier obviously the more
comments I get, the better off I will be, but, um, but, yeah. Oh, look, he's dancing. He's dancing. I knew I was going to get that parry. But parry three times. Bound to get one of them, right? <laughs> Alright. See the crystal golem is back. Let's go up here and get this guy. Whoop. Go away. Then we're going to get some more guys coming in. You know what? Aww. I really wanted to burn him. And we hit this guy. Now, we got the broken pendant. That's what we needed to get. Now we can get out of here. We don't need to fight anything else. Let's get the heck out of Dodge. Oh, you're coming with me? Aren't you nice? Oh, he's going to kill me. Go away. Turd. Okay. So. Actually. Would the sun altar be closer? Yeah. I think it will be. I don't know. I could be real. I could be dead wrong. Because I was thinking I could just run there and go back down, but then I have to run across that. No, 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 no. no. Let's go to Fire Link. Oh gosh, I know there's a way in from Fire Link. Well, there's a couple ways in. I mean, I can go into the Valley of the Drakes. That'll take me in there. Um, but we want. I was thinking up here, up here. She never returned either. I wonder where her Patches is. Because once you complete his storyline, I think I thought he was supposed to come back here to Fire Link and then you talk to him again. Guess not. No, no, no. I have to, I'm gonna have to watch the storyline. See how to do it. I mean, I'm gonna be doing a complete every character storyline when I do my story mode. So you're gonna get every player storyline. I'm gonna try not to mess them up because I know there's certain things you have to stop what you're doing immediately and go do certain things. And okay, so if I go out there, that's gonna take me to Andre. That takes me. I don't remember where that damn ladder is. Alright, you know what? Screw it. What's good, Andre? I don't care. We're go we're gonna take the long way. We're at twenty three minutes. So yeah, we're gonna get to the DLC and then um We get sucked in and then uh, uh, there's a bonfire right there. I will if if we're under the thirty minute mark when we get there, I will try the boss once. Can't promise anything. It's kind of a pain in the ass. We're just gonna go this way. I just, oh, it's bugging me. I don't remember where that stupid ladder go is. That's the great thing about this game is there's so many avenues uh, to get wherever you want to go, and so you tend to forget a couple. You'll forget one here or there. Who are you grabbing at? You grabbing at me? Daku Garden! That other one will stop chasing me. I'm just trying to get down. Just trying to go down, down, down. Dark Root Basin! Yay, we're at the basin! Coo, 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 
Let's go here. We'll go here. Just trying to get there faster. I wonder if you can summon her again. Because I know you can summon her. I think you can summon her twice. Her sign's still there. I don't see it. Nope, it's gone. So I think once you get the once you get the pendant, it's gone. So just like in the painted world, you needed to get that doll to get into the painted world. You need to get that pendant to get into the DLC. Which was I think it's kind of funny because the DLC came out much later in the game after Dark Souls One was released. So a lot of people. Um, may have gotten her early and then went into Duke's Grand Archives and gotten that pendant. I'm like, what the hell is this pendant for? Now you can see there's a portal there. Um, and it wasn't until the DLC came out, you're like, uh, hmm. we got 26 minutes. We got, we have four minutes to try to get in here and jack this boss up. I'll let you guys see what happens. It's like, can I touch it? No, but I touch you. Monkey fist. Some of the more harder bosses in this entire game are in this DLC. Which is, isn't that kind of any, all the Dark Souls games, like the harder bosses are the DLC bosses. They, they look back and they go, we didn't make it hard enough. So we're going to uh, reverse on. I just want to kindle this to 10. I don't want to kindle to 15 because there's a bonfire right after it too. So there's no sense in kindling two of them to 15. I just want to have 10 S just while I'm doing this fight. I only had seven, so. Um, now you can get a weapon. You can get the Guardian's Axe in this fight if you're careful. And you're paying attention to what you're doing. Which I will attempt to do. This dude right here. Run the, do not run straight at him. Or... Evidently, don't run perpendicular to him because he'll just run. Ah, it couldn't stay down long. You want to cut his tail off. Oh my goodness. Alright, we can heal up. A good spanking. Oh no. Listen. We want him to do a jump where he brings his scorpion tail down. Like I say, he's like a lion, bird, scorpion, goat thing. Oh, I got poisoned. Holy shit. I got hit by the tail, that's what happened. Heal up. Dude. Huh. Waste of a drink there. Man, every time I go to drink, he rams me. He's not doing like any of his numb, but he's just doing the same attacks. Stop. Do something else. I want you to do your leaping thing.
I want him to drop his tail. That's what I'm trying to do. This is what I want to do. You can get a hit on that tail. Ah, I dodged that. And when he does that ram, he'll drop his tail too. Got it. See, Gardening's tail. Not too hard to get, you only have to hit it twice. And we'll kill him. Johnson, you guys. What ba da ba So you get the Guardian Soul and we got a humanity. Sweet. And thirty thousand souls. So I can just heal out of this. I don't even need to waste it. So we're gonna go here and we go to this bonfire in the video. So we just started the DLC. Um, took on a boss. Good, good action happening today. And uh, yeah, again, if you guys like these videos, make make sure to hit that like button. Um, let's, oh, I went the wrong way. <laughs> um, make sure you guys hit that like button. Also, uh, uh, leave a comment below. What are you guys thinking of these videos? Um, what's your favorite uh, Souls game? Um, is this one? Is it this one? Is it two? Is it three? Is it Bloodborne? Is it Neo? I mean, it doesn't have to be a Bl Souls game. Is it Demon Souls? I mean, which one is it? Let me know. Um, and then after Dark Souls one ends, what do you guys want to see me do next? That's the other the other question I want to know. Um, do you guys want to see uh, a full playthrough of Dark Souls two and three and Bloodborne and all that stuff? Because um, I don't really have anything till September coming up and when I go to EGX. So, um, yeah. But yeah. I hope everybody has a great day, and like always, I hope you enjoyed the video. Also, there's a description in the link below. Did I say that wrong? That is so wrong. There's links in the description below of other Dark Souls playthroughs that I've done more, there, but those were streams, so they're much longer videos uh, to sit through. Um, but you're more than welcome to check them out. And uh, yeah, I hope everybody has a great day, and I will see you on the next video. Thanks for coming by. And having fun with me. See you later, guys.